What is up, everybody? Welcome back and welcome to Just Us. Today we are reacting to a Supernatural Season 9. Is this Season 9 or 8? Season 9. Season 9, Episode 7. Last episode. <sighs> At the end of the episode, we saw Crowley injecting himself with the blood that made him in the previous season uh, give some of his humanity back, which made him kind of like admit some things to Sam. Mm -hmm. And he was doing it on his own dime. He was, yeah, apparently he was doing it on his own dime for me in this episode. Not obviously because in the yeah. previous episode he was fucking chained up. All right. Um, oh, the, yeah. you remember the girl? Homegirl who would let oh, him babysit? Yeah, babysit? Oh, oh my god, my that. God. Yeah, yeah. And then, yeah, and they had him babysit to go on a date. Now, I don't know about y'all. He got played. But what last episode showed me. Fucking nobody can be trusted. Cause she had me, bro. No, no, I, I thought she was bad into him. She, she, I, I really, I really thought she was bad into him. She but the shit that has me, can't be trusted. Is didn't we see at the end of the episode he was like talking to Dean and then added somewhere at like I don't know what the fuck happened, but Dean dropped him back off at the shop. Yeah, as in he went back to work. Yeah, he went back yeah. to work. I he still needs to pay his bills. He's, okay, he's better. Better. what bills? I would have quit. Like I would have quit. Like you got me. Like no. I'm gonna take care of the store to the best of its ability, and it's gonna be like. My whole thing is she couldn't come into work and me see her, and it just be, hey, hey man, hey, what's his name now? Uh, like Tim or some shit. No, no, that's not Tim. It's um, it's some douchey name. It wasn't a douchey name. It was just a com It was just like a common name. Opposed to Cass. Was it Steve? Ugh. No, it wasn't Steve. Um. I mean, does. It is it a main part of the information that we need to know? You know what I'm saying? We know him yeah. as Cass. I don't think it's a main part of the information we need to know. Because that's like, that's like me asking, what is the shop name of the place that he works at? Is it really going to tie into the storyline later? You know what I'm saying? Also, wasn't the person that she went on a date with the bad guy of the previous episode? Was he an angel or a demon, though? We didn't even get to see who it was. The blonde guy. The blonde oh, guy? Oh, yeah, blonde, yeah, it was. Blonde, it was. as in hair, blonde guy? Yeah, it was. What was what was he? Uh, uh, vampire? Uh, no, 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 no. no, the episode before that he was a vampire. It said, um, "How long ago was that one episode that we watched where the dude like ate animals and then they he had those powers?" That was two episodes ago. That was that was episode eight. It was the snake guy. The because uh, remember at the end of the episode the dogs ended up killing the snake guy. I have to see where would we be without cameras? Oh, no, episode eight. Well, on episode seven. No, you, you're wrong here. No, I'm talking about the episode, the the dog, the that, dog. That was two episodes ago. Yeah, episode well, five. All right, we're currently on episode seven. Yes. Okay, then I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit okay. Was, but he that was, that was right. right. It was two that episodes was, ago. That was my bad. No, but talking about, I was talking about the episode before the episode that we're talking about right now. You see what I'm saying? Oh, so you're wrong. No, I'm technically right because the episode that we just watched was when he got eight. The episode that we just watched was the one where he got stood up. Episode seven was when the dog. This ate is the... episode seven. Okay, so the episode that we the episode that we just watched was episode six. Yes. Which means two episodes ago was the snake guy episode. So it's episode five. Correct. How did you get to eight? Because we were, I just said we were talking about the episode that came before the one that we're talking about right now. The one that we're talking about right now was which the angel five. The one that we're talking about right now, which would it's be six. six. Exactly. So the episode that came before the one we're talking about is five. right now. Exactly. So how did you get eight? My numbers are off, but as far as the it's information, just, as far as the information, I'm here with I you. I get you know? to the information, but I asked him to get to episode eight, and then you started defending yourself. I'm like, bro, what are you doing? Damien was talking, and I got confused. So oh, hell, first of all, pull back. So back it up, back it up. You're not going to blame me previously? No, because no, no, as far no. as numbers, I got confused. You're not going to blame me, bro. I'm no, not, no. Be a man, take accountability. I am Be a man. I am taking accountability as far as my numerology and Why are you laughing? Yeah, Nathan, I'm not going to lie. Be a man and shut up. Okay, what? no, no, one, okay, no, I get it, I get it. We're not happy now. We're not, don't touch me. Nathan, why was that funny? Why the fuck am I getting it? Nathan, just, it's just, L sorry, just, <laughs> Um, um, also in the previous, also in the previous episode, to do, the Rita Zine, that was the that was apparently the blonde guy. It was an angel that came to Earth after losing his wing after losing his wings to continue his work. Regardless, ladies and gentlemen, we have been supernatural deficient. You guys have been supernatural deficient. So let's go ahead and give you guys the best of both worlds and get y'all this reaction. Come on, come on. Hurry. Come on, 
guys. The barn is a no-fly zone during hide and go see. I'm not going in there at night. With your friends? I would. Hey, little bastards. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna. What do we know about that? What do we know about that? When it's cold like that? Demon. Yeah, ghost. Oh, it's bad. This is final destination. Come on. Bro, you see the spikes. Get out of the way. Oh. Yeah, it followed him. Yeah, it followed him, so. I thought it was Dean snoring or something. You remember when we were kids, a spring in upstate New York? They sent me to a boys' home. A boys' home? Like a Damn. reform school? Yeah, more or less. It was a farm, and the guy who ran it, Sonny, he, uh, he looked after me. Why didn't you just tell me you went to a boys' home? I don't know. Uh, it was Dad's idea. And then it just, you know, the story became the story. I was 16. Right. You were here for two months, and Dad couldn't find you. Oh, no, he found me. He found me quick, but he left me here because I lost our money. <laughs> <laughs> what can I do for you, boys? I'm Dean. This is my brother, Sam. I'm real buddies of Sonny's. Prison buddies? Dude. What? Stephen Hewlett caught him red-handed, stealing up at his store. So what did it take? Get this. Look at Peanut that. and bread. OK. What's on his wrist? You see it? Appreciate it, Sonny. I was wondering what's happening to his eye. Where'd you get the shiner? <laughs> you think that's funny? I think you're slow. <laughs> you sucker punch me. You wish. Come on now. <laughs> Billy, I got this, buddy. Wait, I was gonna say, if he, if Dean's that young right there, Sonny must be pretty old. Yeah. And I'll sweat it. <laughs> you ever see the first in um, Incredible Hulk? Doesn't he look like the dad? Yeah, a little without the white hair. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he ages fine. That's really just his mustache now. <laughs> it's like white. Things start happening. You know, lights flickering on and off, strange scratching sounds coming from inside the walls, windows and doors slamming. Yeah, I'm instantly thinking ghosts. Usually when they're ghosts, they have those little trackers, right? The little beeper? Oh. I'm so sorry. I, I I thought I saw something and uh, so then I like, like a ghost. Oh, how the fuck do you know that? <laughs> Four bars. All right, Casper. Anybody here? He's gonna turn on. Oh, that kid's getting fucking drop kicked. What the fuck are you doing? What can you tell me about him? He yelled a lot. He was yelling when he had his accident. How do you know that? Because me and the other boys were playing here when it happened. Well, I think he'd be fucking yelling when he fucking got killed, like... Can I go? I have to finish my chores before Miss Ruth gets mad. <sighs> well, that Ruth, she runs a tight ship, huh? What if there's something wrong with Miss Ruth? For the fact that she knows about the ghost being there, I could, I could yeah. assume. And she's quick to the game. Got life in jail. Which, for Howard, ended a year ago. Is Howard buried here in town? <clears throat> like, this is so disrespectful to constantly be doing that to people. So, yeah. Imagine if they're wrong, too. This isn't the fucking... <laughs> it's a little too early in the show. They're probably going to be wrong. Man. If the next person to die is Ruth, then I'll be like, all right, bet. Yeah. <laughs> like, all right, all right, bet, it's not Ruth. Oh. No, you're saying, all right, bet. All right, well, that's fine. <laughs> no, like, we care about Ruth over here. What well, am? Kick the door. Dog. I would, like, I, I would, uh, I would, like, pop the... Pop the thing to get some like air. If the curtain fell on her though, like something must have been holding it down. You know what I'm saying? Oh, the ghost. Look at Bro on the prowl. That man's doing his gang. 
Dean, you know I'm fine just grabbing a burger to go somewhere, right? Or maybe he knows her. You can stay here as long as you want, Dean. Hey. You're doing good in school, you're making friends, you made the wrestling team. Damn. Yes. Oh, in two months? This is within two months? What the fuck? You'd think the boys' homes would be like, whatever. To never get... It's a very long story. That story have anything to do with why you put salt in front of your bunk door every night for bed? Well, it's a family thing, so I can't really talk about it. Same family that left you here? Yeah. Mm. It's tough. Hey, guys. Hey, Robin, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I told you, I pro it's probably the girl he knows. Robin, told you. Dean Winchester. Look, sorry, there's just, there's so many boys that pass through there, it's, it's hard to remember every, every name and face. Damn. Damn. That must have been his, like, crush, and it just... Yeah. Damn. Damn. Dude. Dude. Let's go. <laughs> go, go. <laughs> Bro, that's hey, so that's so tough. Ruth always had her rosary beads with her, but now you can't find them anywhere. Hey, Sonny, you got any employee records on the victims? In my office. Let's do it. Such a little weirdo. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Hey. Uh, uh, we used to call the warden. She was a real Bible thumping hard ass. Ain't hey. obviously. What else? <laughs> Anything different or weird you could think of? I mean, besides Timmy. Yeah, why? Why would you be? Yeah, damn. Guys like that, they're cowards. Thanks. Okay. All you gotta do is stand up to them one time, and they'll stop. I promise. <laughs> Hey, that where makes me a little bit worried that something could happen, like dangerous. But Cameron, when you if your kid gets bullied, what if, fuck that. He was Sullivan County, 135. The champion in wrestling, that's crazy. <sighs> Seems like so much that Sam doesn't know. Yeah. Hey guys. This is Dean shot, man. She could give me a lesson anytime. Bro, she's like ancient. Damn! Bro, that was fucked up. She is beautiful. That fool is crazy. Ugh. Oh. oh. I wouldn't want to grab it. Hell no. He's watching. Oh. oh. Jimmy's probably working with that. <gasps> oh, it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's so bad. So it's Timmy's feelings. Oh! Oh! So somebody's trying to protect Timmy. I think the doll's possessed. The doll's possessed, and whoever's possessing the doll, or the ghost attached to the doll. Probably ghost possession. Meaning, what, we find Timmy and shove a fistful of salt down his throat? Forced ejection? You're taking the barn this time. I'm thinking, a ghost is possessed by the doll. A ghost is possessing the doll. Yeah, a ghost is possessing the doll, so they need to burn the doll to get rid of the ghost. And the doll is what protects Timmy, and always protected Timmy. But why did... that still doesn't explain why it killed the guy in the barn, though. Or Ruth. Or Ruth. <sighs> Mom got in a car accident. She died, got Timmy out. My dad expects me to follow in his footsteps, so I've kind of gotten used to it. Mm. Yeah, I, I get it. My pops wants me to take over the diner, but that's not happening. Damn. Looks like that might have happened. <laughs> what? Hey, was this his first kiss? He's 16, no way. Have you kissed many girls? Maybe it was, huh? <laughs> yeah, of course. That's why he's grabbing his ear. Sure. So he remembers that, but she doesn't? Yeah, that's tough. That'd no, break my heart. There's no way she doesn't remember. That would really break my heart, because it's like, well, you serious? We gotta get out of here, okay? I don't have time to explain, you just gotta trust me. Trust you. And why would I do that again? again. Oh. You do remember me. They were just, all right. They were really lovebirds. I'm not going anywhere, Robin. Damn. Oh. This is you. Who else would take you to the school dance? That's your way of asking me to be your date, you Winchester. Hey, that man's smooth. What are you doing? Oh. I'm sorry. 
I can't stop it. Oh, damn! I'm like, who the fuck threw that? It's my guy! I can't control her. Can't control Your mom? Your mom, right? Oh, they got me. I'm taking that fucking, that little child's toy and tossing that bitch out the <laughs> window. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I bet she gave you that cool action figure, huh? Yeah, when I turned nine. Cause she's tethered to it, yep. Mm -hmm. Oh! It looks like it wasn't the action figure that was anchoring her here, Dean. Then what is? The boy? No, the boy. That's tough. Y'all just gotta leave the farm, bro. Maybe she doesn't know what threats are real and what's not, so she just attacks all of them. Great, so what? Unless we waste the kid, we're sitting ducks. <laughs> waste the kid? That's this crazy. is crazy. Robin. Robin! Oh, Robin's Robin and Ellis. Ooh. Ew. He said. Oh! We are not here to hurt you. Oh my god. Sometimes you gotta do what's best for you, even if it's gonna hurt the ones you love. Damn, what a bar. You ever Man, you that applies. <laughs> you ever need to hear that today? <laughs> I'm not hugging you. You have to go. I'll be okay, I promise. Oh, she's my Oh. She looked amazing. Why does she look like the girl from, from, First glance, good luck, Charlie. Yeah, I was, I was seeing that too. I look you like I like that. You telling me she? It wasn't like a ghost or nothing like that that possessed her. Just her will to want to protect her son was so strong that she came back from the dead to do that. She's gonna take care of him. No, she's just gonna keep on teaching him guitar lessons. What the fuck is Sunny? Sounds like Timmy's gonna need some help adjusting. What the fuck was he doing that whole shit? No, for real, for real. Take it easy, man. That <laughs> motherfucker really just disappeared, that whole shit. That's how it was He was the ghost. <laughs> he might have been. <laughs> I mean, here I was thinking this was the worst part of your life, and it turns out it was the best. Not the best. Not the best. Why'd you ever leave? Never felt right. You didn't have his brother. And Sam is like, I'm like, watch. Sam plays a great young brother for being like mature one. Sam's a mature one. Yeah. What the fuck? Hell yeah. That fool has been a downer lately. I've never actually been to one of these school dances before. Think about that, Dean. Your old man's outside. I tried to tell him what a big night it was for you, Dean, and ask him if he could come back later, but he just said to tell you he had a job. Damn. I'm not gonna lie. As a Parental guardian, I'd be like, nah, bro, what? So if you want, I'll stick my neck out for you and I'll fight for you to stay. Please don't be her. Oh, it's, uh... So he didn't go because of John. He went because of his brother, Sam. Thank you. For everything. But I have to go. I'm not gonna lie, that was a great child actor right there. You did that. Sam will never realize that, bro. He left for him. Like, my guy. Thank you. Never mind. I like. But we're always being there for having my back. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Well, why the fuck are you pushing me, Davian? These are the speeches that I give to you. These are the speeches you give to me. Yeah, I, it's, that's why I'm hitting you. Bro, we're not watching Supernatural of fucking Sam and Dean, bro. We're watching the super Supernatural of Dean. No. Oh hell no, 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 no. I see what you mean, Ned. No, 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 no. It's not like that. But I'm not gonna lie, the more and more I watch the show, this is Dean's show. She is gay. They need to really shed some light on like Sam being the fucking protagonist. Cause this is Dean's show. It's like fair, season one through five, we're all about Sam. Getting affected for Dean to save him. I'm sorry, Dean's the hero. The fuck? Bro, but like Sam is the damsel in distress, distress. And Dean's always seen, bro. Sam is uh, Daphne, and uh, Dean's funny friend. Said, it's funny how you said that. I was actually thinking of Scooby Doo earlier when we were watching Eight Mile. I just couldn't bring it up. It's crazy, Cameron. It's not like we're twins or anything. 
We just got that connection, bro. You just need to sit here and deal with that. But like I said, bro, Daisy, Fred, run it. Who's Daisy? Scooby Doo. My bad. I thought, Sam. I thought, it's we, were Daisy. Still, I thought we were still on Supernatural for a minute. Oh my bad, not Daisy. Daphne. By the way, hello, by the way, so because she was a ghost, just by the sure will and power and love that you can have for somebody, a ghost can come back and not be te- and technically tether themselves to a human being. That's just my question, Nathan. I guess. I mean, that's what happened, right? Because all I'm saying is she died and her sure will and power had her come back as an evil spirit. Because she wanted to protect her son. She didn't come back as an evil spirit. She came back as a spirit that was... She eventually turned into an evil spirit. By killing those who were quote unquote harming her The herself. longer you're a ghost, the more corrupt you become. Uh, okay, that's fair. I know a bunch of episodes that we watch and stuff are slow or whatever, but this episode was. I know it didn't. This was not on the main storyline, but this episode was fucking gas. But dude, okay, so hold on. From what we know about Sam, uh. Who was his girlfriend before old girl who died? Jess. Before Jess, who was his girlfriend? Nobody. Nobody? Jess was his first? Jess was his college girlfriend. His that, everything? That we all know about, yeah. Oh, man. Because we keep on going into the freaking past, and if it so seems weird. like Dean just... They didn't have much a player like that. But the only real relationship I remember of Dean was Lisa and that other chick. I just don't, I just don't remember her name. The one he, that he was... It was like his actual relationship, the black girl. Oh. That relationship was dope. Eh. Nah, fuck that, bro. That yeah. shit was dope. All relationships that Dean's getting is dope. But the whole Jess thing, bro, I need to see Sam in love again. I know he was in love with that one chick. Um, We've seen Sam in love a lot of times. I, I told you, I said I need to see him in love again. Because the last thing that I remember about Sam was he was with that girl that he ended up leaving. Um, uh, they were, he, She said, if you stay here at the motel or you stay here at this little place, I know you're here for me. The chick that was with her husband or whatever the heck. And then he, she like left him for oh, Sam. Boom. Sam had ended up leaving her to go handle his life. Yep. That's what I'm saying. I need to see Sam in love again, bro. I'm not liking it. Or I need to see Sam have a best friend. You can't just keep on being Dean, bro. Because Dean has had like best friends back to back to back. Little helping buddies and all that jazz, bro. Come on up. But they're not like best friends of Dean. They're just like people that Dean like looks out for. Bro, Benny was what? like his dog. And Cameron Cass is his little boyfriend, but we're not having this conversation, man. You see what I mean? Supernatural, I'm telling you, Supernatural, after season five, they are favoring the fuck out of Dean. Because it's already like, Cass's best friend, Dean. You know what I'm saying? I'm, 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 yeah, Cass's best friend, Dean. Benny the, uh, Benny. Friend of, uh, friend of Dean's. Freaking, um, what the hell's the other dude's name? Even you can see in the way that freaking Bobby and all them talk. Obviously, Bobby cares for Sam, but like even as Sam's an adult, they care for him as like, oh yeah, you're just a younger one. You know what I'm saying? Dean's the adult, and you're his younger brother. You know what I'm saying? Well, I don't, I don't think, well, Cameron, it's, it's David, that is the dynamic. But to be fair, but to be fair, Sam plays such an important role in all the bad guys' plan and plot that he needs a protector. It just so happened Dean fits that role, and then when we see Dean constantly doing hero shit, it has, it has us like him. At that, Supernatural was supposed to end after like season what? Eight? Supernatural was supposed to end after like season five, right? Yeah. It really went from eight to five in like an instant. Because it was supposed to. It was all over. He, he didn't mean for it to go on longer. And the fact that it went on longer, he was like, okay, well, let me revert to something. Let me just give the fans what they want. And giving the fans what they want. I'm pretty sure there was a handful of fan base that was like, oh, we just want Dean, 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 Dean. Okay, bet. We make know, episodes around Dean. They wanted to keep the dynamic of Dean being the big brother to Sam. That's the dynamic they wanted to keep. It's not bad. Not bad at all. It's not bad. You know what I mean? But I can understand what you're saying, bro. You want a little bit more love and light shit it on. It just seems like a lot of the love is spread to me. Yeah. But they didn't move for a loop there, bro. I thought it was really the freaking doll, bro. But it was just tethered to the human being. It's fucking tough, bro. It's tough, tough, tough. That little kid was getting picked, man. Still a great episode, though. I want to know how long the kids were bullying uh, that little boy, bro. Because well, the whole time they were there. Then why didn't the mom bid Ben do that name? Why weren't the Why weren't they the first ones? Sam and Dean weren't there yet, so we couldn't see it happen. Shit! If I was the mom, no, those would have been the first ones, right? Imagine they're playing hide and seek and they're cheating. Oh no, fuck that! 
The mom's on them. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Telling y'all, bro, we love talking to you guys in the comments. We want to see you guys on Twitter as well. So please follow us at just underscore us. YT is in YouTube. If you guys can, hit the notification bell in the bottom right hand corner to be updated upcoming content. But if you miss anything, just hit the logo in the bottom left hand corner. Didn't know, my name's Cameron. Dave. Nathan. Ladies and gents, it's always been just us.